you most pleased with in tonight's win? Uh, when we got out and are down and out of sorts, we were able to rekindle and get back on track. Why do you think you were able to do that? Uh, it's a compliment to the guys. You know, it, we're, it's easy to just get down on yourself and just let the lead go, but we came together and held together and got back. Was there anything from these past couple of days of practice you guys were able to draw from to help aid in that? Right. Uh, one thing uh, I was talking about with one of the coaches, uh, just rest and headspace. You know, that goes a long way in this league. And just our practices, we took it to another level in terms of the intensity and just making sure we had the right things down. You out-rebounded them 45 to 36. This mm -hmm. is a team that obviously all... You know, is a, is a paint first team. Right, how much pride right. you taking that? Uh, that's just how it is with two bigs, and we knew that they were a paint team. Uh, uh, they just had a bad shooting night, so we knew that we needed to pack the paint and rebound the ball. How tough is it to play in a game where the whistles like every ten seconds? Right. Uh, <laughs> It's, it's honestly on us. We were fouling every 10 seconds. <laughs> yeah, and that's just part of the game sometimes. Sometimes it's just the whistle doesn't go your way, and you just have to just play through it and play your own basketball. What do you feel like went right in the first quarter to kind of set the tone in the, on the offensive mm -hmm. end of the ball? Uh, aggressiveness. Uh, people talk about playing defense aggressive, but uh, you can yeah, do it on the yeah. offensive end too. You know, sometimes coming off the pin downs like Sam Merrill does, sometimes you can shoot the ball aggressive. <laughs> You guys held the opposing team to 9% from three. How much credit mm -hmm. do you give to the guards and on open stop them on the transition as well? Right. Uh, big help from the guards. Uh, the guards really held them down at that point from the perimeter. Me and Ever are taking care of the inside. So uh, they did a tremendous job. 9% with two threes they made or something like that. Uh, just an excellent job all around. What was the area of focus you know, when you had that, that break and you took the practices mm -hmm. up a notch? What was the area of focus from those practices that you thought showed up the most tonight? Uh, composure. I, I know it got away from us a little bit, but we still held on and we still were able to hold the lead.